Mm. Morning. Yeah. You're that bad. Mm. Stick the kettle on. Oh. I am just going to sleep here a bit more. Why does the clock say quarter to nine? Probably because it is quarter to nine. Oh. Yeah, I've got work in 15 minutes. Why don't you wake me? Because well, you got in so late from the outline, I just let you sleep in. Oh. Sure, Sarah won't mind if you're five minutes late. Just take a seat and make your coffee. What's this? Someone's fancy mansion? Not someone's. Ours. That's the house that comes with the archdeacon job. I just sent the photos through. <laughs> this is our house? <laughs> One of the bedrooms has got an ensuite. I think it's a bit too big. Too, right? It's massive. Gee, that's what I'm worried about. Feels wrong somehow, big house like that, just for the three of us. It's not wrong. It's a flaming result. What are you doing? I'm sharing this lot to my phone so I can show everyone. Oh, no, Paul, I, I don't think that's a very good idea. I... You're kidding, aren't you? Wait till my man gets a load of this. You best get my skates on. You've got to be kidding me. No, 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 no. I was just resting my eyes. I, I think I've got a migraine coming on. Oh, right. Nothing to do with the fact that you've been yawning since you got here. You know that the order was meant to be out half an hour ago. Right. I'm going now. Yeah. And as soon as you get back, you can take the PPE order to Welly General. I'm right on it. I'll, um, I'll do it after my break. What oh, break? You just had it. What, two minutes shut, I? Listen, you can do it or you can not bother coming back and then you can sleep all you want. See you on the naughty step. Bloody cow. I'd like to see her stay up half the night, man in a phone, then hold down a day job. Is that chat line of yours? Not chat line, help line. Right. Might not be allowed a break, but she can't stop me having a was. Hey, you're back here, eh? Oh, and before you ask, I dropped those boxes at Wevy General, just like you said. Really? And there were no issues? Nope. They love me. They gave me these. Public's donated tons of them. You can't give them away. Well, they did. Have you finished prattling on? Only you need to get back in the van and you need to do the order all over again. What? They need more? Oh, no. You deliver plenty. Except it wasn't PPE. It was peephole bras. What? You delivered the wrong boxes, you dimwit. Whoa, hold on. I double-checked those boxes. The defo said Wevy General. Oh, really? So the, the bra fairy swapped them when you weren't looking? Look, if you cannot do your job, maybe you shouldn't be out all night gallivanting. Gallivanting. Do you want me to spell it out for you? Since when did you become such a snidey old bag? What? Oh, and before you say I'm fired, I resign. That's spelled R-E-S... Whatever. See ya. You've chucked your job in. Why? Well, she was probably going to sack us anyway. Besides, what does it matter now? What does it matter? Well, the house is free, so the pressure's off. And I was thinking we should um, rent out one of the spare rooms, make a bit of extra cash. Get me? Property tycoon. Or not? Look, the more I thought about it, the more it just felt wrong. What did? Us, in a big place like that. Today, OK, I met some homeless people and I felt like such a fraud. They literally had nothing. You're not going to ask them to move in, are you? No. I am going to tell the bishop we're not taking the house. What? I'm sorry. I know you had your heart set on it, but if I'm going to do this job, then I need to act on my conscience. I'm going to ask him if we can turn it into a halfway house. 